Stomach flu is the worst sickness ever. I know there's other sickness that's way, way worse, but right now my stomach flu is killing me. You're not from this planet. Huh? Are you Z? Huh? Uh? How did you, how did you know? It's simple. The way you talk. The way you answer personal questions. If you open your third eye, it's all so clear. You are a lizard person. Uh, huh? A lizard person. The secret ones amongst us. Is this earthling slang for alien? But we've got you guys figured out. You shape shift to fit in on earth and go about society as if you were one of us. Oh no. The reason? Unclear. But there are many theories. One being the study of Earth life to find a safe way to fully take over the planets without struggle. To, to take over? Well, she was right about the fitting in part. But don't worry, Z. Your secrets are safe with me as long as I get special treatment after the uprising. Okay, so I kind of sense something, like, very similar to, um, what's his name? Ethan. Ethan has an obsession with aliens, so right off the bat, he kind of pretty much figured it out, right? But here we can see that Cherry seems to be very into, you know, lizard people or whatever she calls it. Um... And she's probably into it, like people who are very into like Bigfoot or other living creatures back in the day. She's into this. And so she's, <laughs> she's thinking like that, almost like Ethan, like she has a hobby and she's into this. Uh, okay. Sick. Oh, hey. Uh, glad you made it here safe. I'm prepping for close. I, uh, I won't be long. Take your time. Cherry actually walked me here. <laughs> She's so sweet. You good? Yes. Oh, oh, we'll discuss it in the car. Can I wait for you outside? I wish to sit with my thoughts for a bit. Sure. Uh, go out the employee door. I'll take you out. They'll take you outside. I'll meet you out there when I'm done. Thank you, Kate. Clunk. Uh. 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 Go. Stop. Sorry. If I interrupted your alone time, I thought no one would be out here. Uh. You didn't. I, uh, been under a lot of stress lately. I normally don't smoke. Huh? But... I have heard smoking is very bad for you. You heard? <laughs> She's making fun of me. Uh, you're ever Kate, I assume? Yes. He's taking me home. Uh, Bell. Uh-huh. Bell is the only nickname I can think of. I told you I'd come up with one. Maybe I call you Belle? Sure. I like it. It sounds pretty. Hey. Huh? T -t Do you... wanna... go... <sighs> hang out again? Sometimes? Of course. Cool. See you then. Okay. Hmm. So, what were you wanting to tell me? You said we'll discuss it later. Ah, uh, yes. It is about Cherry. Um, Kate, is it obvious that I am, well, different? Huh? Where is this coming from? What will you answer? 
Uh, I don't know. It's hard to say. I already see you a certain way. But do I think it's obvious? No. Not really. Cherry found out I was an alien. Uh, what? Uh, how? What happened? I, I do not know how. She simply guessed. Wait, hang on. How'd she phrase it? She worded it like, you are a lizard person. Or something like that. Oh, Cherry called me a lizard person too. A long time ago. Then was it only a joke? Honestly, when it comes to Cherry, I think we shouldn't worry about it. She's never too serious for it to matter. She seems to really like you anyway. She likes me. Ow, ow, ow! Headaches. Maybe we should call it for gaming tonight. Huh. Let's try headache medicine. Here. It's what I take when I'm having a migraine. I'm not sure how well it will work for a Zodian, but I'm sure it'll be okay. Go, go. Thank you, Kate. I will stay up with you for a while, just to make sure you don't have any weird side effects. <laughs> you are so sweet. I will be all right. I am so very hungry. Oh, where's food? Better to be safe than sorry. Was that Cosmo? I desire attention. Oh, wait. Give me pets. Uh-uh. Kate, did you hear that? Huh? Hear what? Only I hear Cosmo? <gasps> I suddenly have to potty. Okay. Take your time. No, no, no. <gasps> uh, uh. No way. Not now. Down to earth. What is going on? So she can... She can read animals' minds or hear what they're saying? And she's getting migraines and she's glowing and she's having flashbacks. What is going on? I hope she's okay. Another cliffhanger, of course. I don't know. We keep hitting it right on a good spot. <sighs> Alright guys, if you guys enjoyed the way I read this and react to this webtoon, feel free to subscribe, leave a thumbs up, drop some comments, and I'll catch you guys next time. Bye!